This is Bacon Martin, Orbis Wildlife Biologist and Falconer. This video will be presenting a series of clips showcasing the response of pest birds to falconry abatement, a service Orbis began offering in 2019. Falconry abatement is defined as using falconry trained birds of prey to abate pest birds. In the fall of 2019 and 2020, Orbis provided abatement services for Indiana small plots in northwestern Indiana. ISP grows small plots of corn and sorghum. For about three weeks every fall, brown-headed cowbirds stop by on their migration path to fill up on the sorghum and have eaten 50% of ISP sorghum crop in the past. Orbis's 2020 team of abatement falcons included Sinbad the Saker Falcon, Pike the Peregrine Falcon, and Bo the Lanner Falcon. In each of these clips, you will see Master Falconer Mark Booth working with his birds Sinbad and Pike. You also see the immediate response of the cowbirds to the falcons. When watching for the falcon in each clip, look for the larger bird with long pointed wings and long tail. Here you can see cowbird response to Sinbad taking flight. Even when he is not flying towards them, Simply the shape of the falcon in flight is a deterrent for the cowbirds. Pike makes short, low circles around Mark, flying over the corn small plot and intimidating the cowbirds roosting on the irrigation pivot. Watch the cowbirds ball up and dart back and forth. This behavior is called a murmuration and is meant to confuse falcons or other aerial predators that may be hunting the cowbirds. This clip shows Sinbad seemingly corralling the flocking cowbirds as they fly past. Other than simply releasing the falcons to fly, another behavior we can mimic through training is the falcon hunting stoop. Pest birds interpret this stoop, or downward dive of a bird of prey, as a hunting raptor. Sinbad is responding to a swinging lure. As Sinbad flies past, Mark pulls the lure away, and the bird flies up and turns back around to try again. This is called lure flying, and has been used in the past by falconers to increase fitness in falcons flown for hunting. Mark eventually serves Sinbad the lure, and he gets to eat food that is attached to it. Here you can see Sinbad stoop in slow motion, and more clearly see the swinging lure. Once the three weeks of falconry abatement were complete, Orbis drafted a report for ISP detailing abatement effectiveness and diagramming cowbird roosting and foraging behavior to aid in management outside of the migration season. If you are interested in more information about Orbis's falconry abatement services, contact me at mmartin at orbisecc.com.